Welcome back to Disabled and Prepping and today I am going to show you what I got at the farmers market on the way to a birthday party for a little six-year-old. Um, so I had a great time at the party but well, since I was going through the farmers market I decided to pick up a few things if they had it and so I picked up six heads of broccoli all kind of about this size um, so I picked up six of them. It was a certain amount. It wasn't very much actually, um, but I picked up six of them because I wanted more last time, and I didn't. I, and then last weekend they didn't have any, so I picked up double the amount I normally would have picked up, uh, just because I knew last time I wish I would have grabbed more. So I grabbed six uh, little heads of it like this. They, they don't give you a big old head anymore. Anyways, um, well some of them are a little bit bigger than that, but not by much. And I use the stalks too, so um, all I do is cut off the little little bit of the end here where it's a little, little rough around the edges. So I'm going to add those to my food. Um, I even use the little leaves and stuff that they have attached. And I use the stems up. I just cut the little bit off the, the end that doesn't look good after being oxidized for a while. So I picked up that. So six of those. Those are going to go in my refrigerator because uh, it's the afternoon now. Um, and I picked them up at like 11, uh, 11 o'clock or so. So they've been in my backpack on my power chair all afternoon. Um, so my backpack smells like broccoli. Yay! Um, and then I picked up two different kinds of cherry tomatoes. These that are darker, almost similar to a chocolate tomato, but I don't remember what he calls them. They're not the same. And then these little ones that he calls pink ones, but they look red. They're just a little bit less red than the other ones. So I picked up two um, bunches of those and um, I gave him his containers back. I said, just put them in a paper bag. Um, so he, he gets those back and then I'm going to put this in the bag that I already have in my fridge that has just a few left from last time. So keeping that in stock and then um, I went to the birthday party, had a great time. Um, and then on the way back I stopped to get ice cream because we had cake but no ice cream. <laughs> and I was really craving ice cream by that time so I grabbed a little thing of, um, I went to Dollar General and I picked up a little thing of ice cream and I got drumstick ice cream so I'll have that after dinner tonight oh at the party we had hamburgers or the choice of hamburgers brats or hot dogs and a bunch of different uh, fixings for uh, like they had a loaded mashed potato potato salad um, it looked really good and when I got to try it, it was really good. So I'm going to have to try to see if I can find a recipe for that. Um, I don't know, it wasn't called loaded potatoes, but it had mashed potatoes, uh, hard boiled eggs, bacon pieces, I, I don't know what was all in it, but it was really, really good. Um, and you know the normal picnic kind of things. We had some pasta salads there, it was really a lot of fun. Um, and watching the kids, it was just, it was so much fun. <laughs> they were running like little wild Indians all over the place. And then on the way back, um, I stopped in to get the ice cream. And um, these were on discount, so a dollar fifty a piece. So I picked up two Snapple Air um, Elements, and it's the prickly pear. Uh, peach white tea so it sounded really good I think I've had this one before but I don't know but um, I'm pretty sure I did and I really liked it uh, there was another one that I really liked too but I couldn't find it so I picked up two of those um, there to go in the fridge and then I found two items that I uh, I'm gonna use for preps because uh, I haven't seen these before and they were in your, their dollar section so they're shower vapor tabs hopefully eh, it's backwards for you guys I'm sorry um, so it's it says shower vapor tabs there's only four tabs in there so they got to be some pretty good size let's see if I can if, the, if 
they're available to see. Uh, let me get my big old knife here. Where my, not a big old knife, but little one. And we'll see. Oh, they're not even that big. They're only this big. But that's okay. I mean, probably wouldn't want a huge wafer in the shower. But uh, I picked them up because <laughs> I can use hot water here. Yay, me! Um, no more cold showers. Uh, so I figured I'd uh, get a few of them. Um, they are non medicated, but they are soothing, relieving vapors with eucalyptus and essential oils. So I figured they might come in pretty. Oh, I'm sorry, it was a glare. Um, they might come in pretty handy in the winter, or like if I get. Cause if I end up catching a cold, it goes right to my lungs, because uh, I almost died. I came within a half hour of dying, according to the emergency room. Um, so, if I get a cold and I don't get a grip on it quickly, it goes to my lungs. So, I figured, um, grab two of these right now. They were in the dollar section, so they were obviously a dollar. Um, but, let me make sure, because there were some things that were placed that weren't a dollar. Um, yeah, they were a dollar, two for a, at a dollar, so, so yeah, I thought that was a pretty good pickup for a dollar, um, vaporizer, uh, vapor tabs for the shower, um, they will be great if they work to decongest, um, so I'm picking up, I picked up two of them, and I probably will pick up a few more, um, just to have them, um, I don't know if I'll pick them up now or next year, but, uh, I got eight of them right now, so, or eight tabs, uh, two boxes of oh, four. So, yeah, that's what I picked up. Um, the tabs, I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna get a small, tiny stockpile of them, just because I don't need them that often, and, but I think they will come in very good, uh, come in handy. <laughs> Boy, y'all, my words are just not here this weekend. Um, but, yeah, I, th I think they'll definitely c be useful if I'm stuffed up or congested, or even think it, or start to feel it coming on. Maybe I can kick it out right away. Uh, but, I'm just picking up things that I think I could use, well, that I know I could probably use. So, um, that's all I got, uh, but, um, I, well, I did get this in the mail, and I'm going to do, um, I'm going to post it on my community tab, but, uh, again, it's going to be backwards, but Fond du Lac is having a road show, but, um, they have, this is buying event, uh, also, so it's, Five days only, Tuesday, August 20th through Saturday, August 24th. Um, yeah, so, but they have some gold and silver. I might go see what, what it's all about. Um, I don't know. They have other things as well. But I'll post a photo of it so you can see it better. I'll post photos of it all so you can um, see it a little bit better on my community tab. And of course, I'm going to block out my address for all of those internet trolls. Not from you guys, uh, I, you know, but you know how it is being on the internet. You just can't have everything going out there. So anyways, um, they also have this stuff in the flyer too. So I don't know. I mean, there, there might not be anything that I maybe can afford, but I might see if I can go. If it's a nice day, I might head out there and just see. Um, who knows, maybe there'll be some dimes or something there that maybe I could pick up. Because I guess the dimes are only a couple of dollars a piece. I don't really know. But, uh, that's what I hear anyway. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to post a photo of it and uh, show you what it's all about. Um, God, I really said um a lot today in this video. But this is... It's, pretty much what I have. I don't have anything else really to show you today, but, um, oh, I took all the, almost all the kids. 
on the train for a gift because I, I, I didn't know what she wanted or anything and her mom said don't worry about it uh, but I took them all on the train so they got a train ride uh, so and so did this big kid this big kid got a train ride too <laughs> so um, but it was fun they all the little ones had a blast on the train and they also said they weren't scared of the tunnel <laughs> so I said that's okay you don't you weren't supposed to be scared of the tunnel so I, I had a fun time and they had a fun time which was the most important thing is that they had a fun time so it was too cold to do the splash pad which is what they were kind of do, wanting to do but um, we made different arrangements and everything worked out so alright everybody have a wonderful day wonderful night depending on when you watch this may God bless each and every one of you to overflowing and may he keep you your friends and family safe Bye for now.